these words. Ugh, why does this have to be so painful? I would just like whiter teeth, please. Welcome back to my channel. All right, I'm so late to the train, but I decided to give it a go. I really want whiter teeth, but my teeth are so sensitive that I just can't use white strips. My teeth are feeling just a little yellow, so I'm gonna give it a go. I bought this one from Amazon. It was actually 50% off and it had really good reviews, but I'd say about half the comments said it made people's teeth sensitive, so I'm a little bit scared. I did watch a lot of videos, read a lot of blogs online to look at some hacks for how to avoid sensitivity. So I'm going to give it a go and I'm going to show you the tips. So come along with me and I'll let you know if it works and if my teeth are aching. I I, I sure hope not. Alright, so this one I bought is the Crest 3 White Strips Dental Whitening Kit Professional Effects and it says 13 levels whiter. I don't know how they determine that my teeth will get 13 levels whiter, but hey, 13 levels whiter than this shirt. Now I know my teeth are super yellow, but when I drink a fair amount of coffee, I feel like they get really stained. This is interesting. Like, is it a good sign that I can't even open it? All right, I got it. I wrecked the box a little bit the other day. But it looks like there's 22 treatments here. One of the tips I read was that you don't want to brush immediately before because that will make your teeth a little bit sensitive. Making sure you brush a couple hours before and not immediately before. So yeah, it looks like it's there's a whole bunch of packets in here, 22 treatments, so I'm gonna open one up. It says, heal, apply, and smile. Okay, I need more direction than that. Um, how long do I leave it on for? 30 minutes. One of the hacks I read is that the reason we get sensitivity is because, geez, I'm having a hard time here. We wrap it around the bottom and that's what's creating sensitivity. So there's a hack that if you take clean scissors, I've got some clean scissors here, I'm actually gonna cut it so that it doesn't wrap around the bottom. Like, how much did, how do I know how much to cut off? I don't know. Okay, well, I'm gonna cut a little bit off the bottom. Okay, so I'm gonna do this every day for 22 days, and I guess we're gonna see if my tea get 13 shades whiter, not wrap it around the bottom. I need a little egg. Okay. So I didn't wrap it and then hopefully they stick. I'm gonna do some work for 30 minutes and then I'm gonna come back and take them off. Um, hopefully I don't experience any sensitivity. Just love, love the way it feels and uh, love the way I sound. Talk soon. I feel like they already look whiter. Ooh. All right, day one done. Okay, day two. So far so good. I swear last night, I was feeling a little sensitivity, but probably psychosomatic. There's no way that I would feel sensitivity after one use. I mean, maybe. Who knows? Okay, so it's been several days of using the strips in a row and I haven't experienced any sensitivity yet, which is crazy to me because usually it's on day two or three that I experience it. I think it's about six days now. I haven't had any sensitivity. I do think it is the fact that I'm not wrapping the strip all the way around my teeth. I did read that using a sensitive toothpaste two weeks leading up to when you're going to start the strips and then obviously after helps as well. So I just grabbed this like Colgate sensitive from the uh, drugstore. It was only $3, but I know, you know, there's other brands that exist like Sensodyne. I've been brushing with this and yeah, so far so good. So I will keep you posted on how it's going. All right, we are about halfway through our Crest White Strips Challenge for Sensitive Tea. And so far, so good. I have used several hacks so far that I've shared and I haven't experienced any sensitivity, which is bananas. I felt like there were a couple times maybe where I was drinking cold water where I could feel something, but I don't know if I was just overthinking things. One of the most obvious hacks for sensitive tea is to take a break from the white strips. You won't lose your progress. Obviously, it'll take longer for you to complete the 22 treatments. 
But taking a break if you're experiencing any type of sensitivity, using the sensitive toothpaste that we talked about, and then going right back into using the white strip. I just got back from Vegas and I did take the white strips with me, but I couldn't find the opportunity to use them. So I brought them back home with me and that was about a three to four day break where I wasn't using them and I'm right back into it. So far so good. So wish me luck. Again, all I really want is like teeth. I'm definitely noticing a difference and I can't wait to see the final results. All right, so just checking in and I don't know, lately I feel like my teeth aren't getting any whiter than they are right now and I definitely feel like they have a ways to go. So I'm going to keep at it and I mean, I think I still have a fair amount of treatments left, but I'm hoping my teeth still get whiter than this because they still have a yellow tinge to them. Um, I mean, I say this as I, as I drink my coffee, but I... I just want them whiter, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep at it, and um, I'm hoping that I can I don't know break down these years and years of stains that I have on here. So keep you posted. Ta-ta. I think I have about seven days left in the white strips, and I cannot believe it. I have zero sensitivity. I have gone 15 days of using strips um, with a little bit of a break in between, but oh my goodness, I have tried for so many years to use white strips and I never make it past day two or three. I've tried white strips for sensitive teeth. I've tried Amazon, like knockoff sensitive teeth ones. Um, I tried the sensitive teeth one with the light to see if that would help. Nothing, like I've never made it past day two or three. I honestly think it's the not wrapping of the white strip on our teeth that's, that's making the difference. Obviously I'm still using the sensitive toothpaste as well. And I, I, I just can't believe it. They're definitely whiter. I put a white shirt on so you can kind of see the difference. Um, I can't wait to see what the next seven days brings. And I'm hoping that it's something that I can do annually now to maintain white teeth throughout the year. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Um, I will say there's one more hack that I did read online that I don't that I haven't had to use yet. And that is actually rubbing the sensitive toothpaste a little bit on each tooth before putting the white strip on. And that apparently is supposed to help as well. Maybe not as effective, but just still better than better than nothing. Right? Cannot wait for the next seven days. Um, yes, it's been years of drinking coffee, drinking red wine, and ah, we're getting there. I did it, I made it. 30 days, 22 treatments of the Crest White Strips and I had zero sensitivity. I've never been able to finish a box of Crest White Strips. I just have piles and piles of them that I've ended up throwing out over the years and I cannot believe that I actually finished a box. So I'm so, so happy that other people have posted online different hacks that they have used that have worked for them because they definitely work for me. I did not have any sensitivity at all. In fact, I even feel like some days I left the Crest White Strips on for slightly longer than 30 minutes. Um, you know, if I get distracted with my kids or work or something. Previously, when I tried to use them, there's no way, like I would, start feeling pain in my teeth if I left them on for even a second longer. Are they 13 shades wider? I'm very, very pleased with the results. I highly, highly recommend trying these hacks if you have tried to use Crest Right Strips and have struggled with teeth sensitivity over the years. Feel free to ask any questions below, drop a comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you so much for coming along in these 30 days with me. I'm super stoked that it worked. If you can't tell, can't stop smiling. I share all things wellness, fitness, and how I fit into my busy schedule as a mom of two. Thanks so much for watching and bye for now.